Hey guys, it's Chrissy from Chrissy's Cupboard. I just wanted to share a quick little hack with you guys that will help you to prolong your sea moss life. So I just finished making my own personal sea moss. I made the apple pie flavor. It's one of my favorites. And I have some leftover that I didn't have enough to put in the jar and I wanted to just freeze it for future use. Remember guys, when you freeze your sea moss, it could last up to three months. That's a lot. And that's great because you get a lot more for your buck. So I did promote on my website and on my Facebook and Instagram pages that you can free sea moss and they have little mason jar bags that you can actually order off of Amazon. But if you don't have that and you just wanna be like, you know what, I'm gonna use what I have at home, these work too. You can use ice cube trays if you wanna have something like a little snack. You know, whatever flavor you like, it works. But these work as well. So. I'm gonna show you. Okay, so here's the leftover sea moss, and all you're gonna do, very simple, like when you make a smoothie, you're just gonna pour it in the bag. And you know what, the first thing, I don't have a marker on me, but just, you know, for you guys to see, you would take the marker, you would label it the date, and then you would put, you know, when it would expire, which you would say three months for that. Just a little reminder, you should do that with any food that you freeze, you should always put a date. So that's pretty much common sense, but with the sea moss, that's what I would recommend. When you do defrost it, um, you know, you can put it back in a blender, you can add it into something, however you choose to do, but it will be just as fresh and just as good. Now, when I do sell my products, I don't free sea moss and then sell them. I'm just giving you guys this little hack to do on your own so you can get more money for your buck. So what you'll do is you'll take all the air out and after it's labeled, and I'm making a mess, but here you go. That's all you do, put it in the fridge. Okay, so like I was saying, that's all you need to do. I hope you guys enjoyed this little hack and I will definitely be on to show you guys some more. Thanks for supporting my company, peace and blessings.